Hi everyone, this is Jason with Schleiz Bones Line Supplies. Today I wanted to talk about repotting. This is typically one of the main reasons why a lot of the people that I've dealt with in the past that have had problems with their trees that are coming from up north have ended up killing the trees. Here in central Florida, a lot of my maples will actually start sprouting in January, which up north they're still under a couple feet of snow. However, January is the time when the buds start to swell. Uh, most of my junipers all get repotted at the end of January. I have them all repotted by the end of February. Uh, we are also repotting all of our black pines around the same time. And an easy way to tell when it's time to repot your black pine is if you pull it out of the pot, you'll see all of the roots have started issuing white root tips because they're beginning their active growth. That's the time to repot them. Uh, and that's when I have the minimal amount of stress on the trees. It's typically just before or just after the buds have started to activate and that is an optimal time to repot them. Um, by April we're starting to get into the 90s. By May and June it's too hot to repot a lot of the deciduous trees uh, without giving them some sort of stress. So it's really important to look at your trees and listen. Also if you live in a hotter zone Find a nursery, a bonsai nursery specifically, that grows the type of tree that you're wanting to know what's a good time to repot. They typically will know right down to the week what is an optimal time to repot uh, that particular variety. Uh, as far as my tropical trees, uh, I know a lot of the books that I've read have said any time. That's not the case here. We do get about three or four months of cool weather and we do freeze. If you repot a tropical tree and it gets down below 45 degrees, you're going to have problems with the root tips going dormant and if they stop growing, there's a possibility that they will start to rot, especially if you've recently repotted them and cut the roots and now you have open wounds there. And if they're not callousing over and creating new root tips, you get a cold snap. Um, the trees tend to stay too wet because they're not drying out, they're not respiring moisture out the leaves and you can start having issues. So we always repot our tropical trees when the nights are above 60 and when they're continuing to be above 60 for at least six weeks. So we'll repot our tropical trees from May 1st, clear all the way into um, August 31st, uh, sometimes as late as, as September 15th. Because we're not thinking what the temperature is on September because September is really hot here. What we're looking at is six weeks of growth after that and at that point we're going to start getting cool snaps here and if we have a couple cold nights it can be a problem so we typically stop around september uh, first uh, repotting our tropicals thank you very much for watching and if you like the information that we had to share please uh, like us and share us thank you